Hello and welcome to another Science Man digital lesson. Today we're going to look at an interesting problem with human vision and that's nearsightedness. Now to understand it we need to know a little bit about the optics of the eye. So what I've created here is a model of the human eye where right in the middle we have our lens. We have a lens inside of our eye and it sits near the front of the eye and the back of the eye has the retina and that's right over here in our model and that's just represented by a, a white screen. So when light comes into the eye and uh, is focused by the lens it uh, normally falls into focus on the retina. But this person is having a problem. They're trying to look at this uh, nice bright uh, beautiful hot air balloon uh, but on the right side we can see here that the image is horribly out of focus on their, their retina. And uh, you can see the problem, the, the image with the little green arrow right here is falling in front of the retina. So this person has a problem and we need to fix it. Now they could go for lens uh, corrective uh, laser surgery um, but we could try the old-fashioned way of just putting a lens in front of their eye. So uh, in, in effect wearing glasses. So that's what we'll do. We'll take this um, uh, convex lens first and try that. So I'm just going to take this convex lens and put it right in front of their eye and wow that seems to have made the situation worse. Um, we can see that the image is even blurrier and the image is moved even further away from the retina and that's not what we want. We want the image to fall on the retina. So what we need, I think, is some way of spreading the light rays out before they reach the lens. And that will make them converge, converge further back uh, near the retina. So let's try a concave lens. So we'll just grab this concave lens and drag it right in front of the lens of the eye and then if we put it in the right position about where glasses would rest when they're sitting on your nose right in front of the real lens of the eye we can see that oh lo and behold we get the image falling right on the retina and the person has a beautiful hot air balloon of course upside down that's the way it forms on the retina the image forms on the retina but it's perfectly in focus so if we have a nearsightedness problem we can correct it using a uh, diverging concave lens which spreads the light out before it reaches your real lens in your eye and then the light focuses properly on the retina and that's a that's an interesting solution for uh, the problem of nearsightedness now Thanks for viewing this uh, digital lesson. If you want to try it yourself, you might want to use uh, Yenka. That's what I used. Uh, if you haven't downloaded the software yet, try it. It's fantastic. Just go to yenka.com. Thank you.